Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kim, America's Holistic Foot Doctor. In this video, you meet my patient who has extremely deep, pinched, and cracked callus. Due to the pressure between the bunion and the ground, the callus was developed, then cracked when it got thicker. Let's see how I can help her. So now we have Catherine here. How are you doing? Sorry? How are you doing? Oh, okay. I was listening to your <laughs> to video out there. Oh, really? And I love what you said. To have a stress-free life and to try to make yourself happy. And I'm saying, okay, tell me the secret for a stress-free life. <laughs> and the secret how to make yourself happy when things go wrong, right? I know. That, that's, the, that's the big, 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 big if, right? So she's here today. This is a what we call a pinch callus, but it's cracked. So basically what happened is when you're standing here and the foot's coming down, things get pinched and then the shoes is rubbing. So it forms a callus, but it gets so thick that it cracks right in there. So I'm just gonna clean this uh, pinch callus. Pretty common problem, especially when they have a little bit of bunion going on and it's pushing against uh, the bottom of the bottom of the foot and also the shoes. So I have to be extra careful because she's on a blood thinner. So I have to be like very careful getting to this callus so she doesn't bleed. So I very carefully dissect this out. You don't, definitely don't want to bleed. I'm sorry? I definitely don't want to bleed here. So we do very carefully and then we'll smooth it down after it's done so that it doesn't become a problem. So is this pretty painful or not extremely painful? Is this painful for you? No, I usually try to cut it like at least every other week. Oh, really? Yeah. What do you use? I have that. Like a pumice stone? The, the, rust, the razor, you know, with the, with the handle. Uh huh. Especially for something like this. And I, when it's wet, you know. It's I, easier. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Unfortunately, we don't have access to the, the tub, so we're just going to do it this way. I kind of like it when it's drier because it's easier for me to cut it. You okay? How long you've had this callus? For a while? Forever. Forever, huh? Well, like I said, I you know do it myself every two weeks, every three. It depends on what's going on in my life, so. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. How long does it take you to do this? Well, not long. So you got good at it. Uh, I mean, I just you know I just don't go like nice the way you do. I just when it's wet, just scrape it down and. Uh huh. Then you're done. I be careful, you know, not to bleed. Uh huh. Hi, it's me again. Hope you've been enjoying this video so far. If you have, leave the word pinched and cracked in the comments below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'm gonna move this up a little bit. How do you like this jazz music? <laughs> it's fine. Yeah. Just to, I'm trying to relax you while you're <laughs> getting this cut. Because you're on a blood thinner, I'm gonna be more careful. So instead of keep going deeper, I'm gonna just nicely grind this down for you, okay? Okay. 
in the stuff. Good. So we'll carefully cut some callus, and then now we're just gonna very carefully grind this down because we don't want any, we don't want any trouble with uh, this callus. So we'll very carefully. Very smooth. I can go a little deeper, but I don't want to do too much. smooth. I don't want to do too much. Okay, thank you for allowing us to film it today. Thank you for watching this video. As you can see in this video, a callus can form between the bunion and the ground and it gets thick and when it gets really thick it cracks and then it can bleed also if you don't take care of it early enough. So be careful when you have this cracked calluses and make sure that you take care of it before it gets worse. Until then, be educated, get empowered, encourage others today.